Okay. So everything, everything starts in the campaign folder. So now all we're going to do is we're going to click on the green button and we're going to create. Perfect. So now as we come over here, we're going with conversions. Okay. Okay. So it's create then conversions. Yep. And then all you're going to do is you're going to scroll down, hit that drop down, and, and let's name everything right now. So the name of the the name of the campaign is going to be the name of that video. So springtime video or whatever the hell you want to, you know, name. Start naming your videos, not just for this purpose, but just name them in general, you know. Okay. So spring selling season and then in parentheses, conversions. Always put that in there? Yeah, in parentheses. That way, when you look at the dashboard, you know what ad that is rather than having to click on it and then go into it. You can just view it from the from the dashboard and see that it's a conversion ad. Okay. So the title is 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 important for for that reason. Um, the ad set go ahead and go with the same targeting your um your your fifteen mile radius. Just name so it. Yeah, you don't need anything in the drop down. Okay. Yeah, just name it. Should I say twenty? You do you yeah, think I should? Let's, let's, yeah, let's open it up a little further. Let's go twenty for sure. Do it for a while and see how. It goes. Yeah. Perfect. And then the name, the, the ad, I would just name the same spring selling mm -hmm. season. And then right there, you could put spring selling season video, video. That way we know, you know, the ad is an actual video versus an image okay. or, or in then in the future, if you run an image, put image, you know, spring selling okay. season image. So I guess I could do that too. I'm going to, I'm hoping I'm going to remember all this. Okay. Now, this one right here, believe me, this will be on my YouTube channel. Uh, view it later on view this view this tomorrow i'm gonna have it live tomorrow for you okay so hit Had you yesterday i'm sorry i didn't get to it no no worries doctor yeah how'd it go what's that how did oh, your it was it was good it was good yeah. i was on there with with one of my friends from exp and just taking her through just um updating her seller guide landing page oh okay good yeah i'm gonna um put a new seller's guide on my email by some chance that somebody might click on it because i i've downloaded the new spring one now Perfect. and as far as my my little one that i use as a prop i'm just going to change the cover because nobody mm. will know what's in it it's about the same anyway perfect okay okay so, so continue continue and then it'll bring us into step one which is just simply choosing the um drop down so we'll see the drop down oh, there we have to do this we'll add housing absolutely mm -hmm. And then we'll scroll down and we'll just make sure that the campaign budget optimization is turned off, which it is. So perfect. So now hit next. So that's the first tab. That's that's the campaign. We're going with conversions. We're going with housing. That's step one. OK, okay. so now we come over here to step two. And all we're going to do is we're going to choose our pixel. So go ahead and select well, your pixel. You, oh, so it takes you right to set step two. Yes. Okay. So now pixel. we're in the second tab. And all we're going to do is choose our, our pixel right there. Yeah. Yep. And then choose the event, the conversion event. You'll see seller guide leads. Perfect. Okay. Okay, cool. And then we'll scroll down. And then we don't need dynamic creative. We don't need offer. We'll go ahead and go on this one. We'll go. Um, and you know what? Let's let let's kind of flip it up a little bit. The, the other one we went with lifetime. In this case, let's go with daily. Same budget, but let's just let's just change it up. Let's change up the way it's spent. So let's just oh. go daily. So let's go daily, um, $10 daily. And then we'll just set the same seven day period. So it's seven, so it's $10 and then, and what then go. Later, I want it to keep going. Then, then we'll, we'll, and that's why a lot of times putting an end date is not always, is not always the best option because yeah, if you want it to keep going, then, mm -hmm. then then let it keep going. And if you need to just manually, and especially, you know what, I'm going to, I'm going to advise you to do it, to do it this way. No end date, because in the very beginning with these first few ads, we're going to kind of micromanage them to, to a certain extent, you know, we're going to, okay. we're going to review them in a few days. So um, if needed, we'll I'm shoot it off. Videos. I've, I've come across a couple of great ideas because, you know, I always read the real estate web uh, Facebook pages that I am yeah. connected to. Mm -hmm. I read everything people say. And so, so I was going through and somebody was talking about videos and they asked about um, teleprompters. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, teleprompters? Yeah. And <laughs> I need a teleprompter. Mm -hmm. So I got a teleprompter now on my phone. 
So I'm so relaxed about it now because wow. yes. And then I want to do a video tour instead of paying for a video tour on my listing. Uh-huh. So I'm going there today and I've got another app that will flip the camera so that Amazing. I can have me and then flip it to the house. So I'm, I'm learning. Awesome. Awesome. Um, awesome. Yeah. And, and again, there's so much stuff out there. Keep it simple. The, the more authentic, the better. You don't need no camera crew next. Don't go hire yeah. a camera guy next. Like keep yeah. it simple on your cell phone, but whatever you can leverage and whatever can make it easier then yeah, for sure. Yeah. But don't feel you need to get too fancy. You know? Okay. Um, one of all. them was free. One of these apps, I think the flip one was free, but awesome. the, um, the other one, the um, teleprompter, I paid $50 for six months mm-hmm. only because it keeps the, their logo off it. And I didn't really want their logo. Gotcha. On it. Yeah. Okay, cool. Right on. Mm-hmm. So yeah. what we'll do though, in, in this case, the start date, let's at least do the start date and okay. then we'll always choose the next day. So All right. oh, today is the ninth. Okay. The yeah. Let's 10th. go March 10th and go ahead and go 6 a.m. March 10th. So there's the 10th and go ahead and go 6 a.m. And just, and just start it then. Perfect. Okay, cool. That's okay, good. Okay, 6 a.m. Okay, good. Now, again, $10 is the absolute minimum. As, you, as we really roll this out and you make your money back by closing your first escrow, right? Right. From, right. This, from this campaign, that's when you're going to want to go to $20 a day. And, yeah. and that's kind of the max you'll be at. You really won't need to be higher than that. But, but $20 a day, $600 overall for the month. I'm telling you, Facebook ads is all you need to be doing. Like, so that's just my personal well, as professional soon as opinion. I, yeah. As soon as I see any results, I'm happy to yeah. do that. But I got to see something. Oh, even for some, sure. You know, even if I get any leads out of it that don't result in a closing at, right yep. away. For sure. But for sure. For some, yeah. Yep. So right here, we're going to just simply, we won't even, we won't even narrow it down to a custom audience yet. Let's not even, we won't even mess with that yet. Let's just go down to locations and go people living in this location. So hit the drop down, people living in. Um, I'm looking for, oh, there we go. So we'll go always people living in this location and then go ahead and type in the location right below and put in your 20 mile radius. So just, um, gosh, can't type when I'm on the phone with you. For some reason, yeah, <laughs> you get stage fright. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> For some reason, okay. Okay, cool. So that's I have to say twenty miles somewhere, right? Where do I? St- Is that it that? right there? Anytime Fitness. No, it wasn't supposed to be. And I okay, so X that it. out. Yeah, let's yeah. let's type it again. Yeah. Okay. Oh, and it still says fifteen, so I have to make it twenty. One one four zero zero West P A R M E. That's right across the street from me, so it wouldn't hurt. But, okay, good, perfect. Uh, but I just thought I had seen it. Yeah, it's right there below. There, yeah, right there. There we go. Okay, cool. So let's let's change yeah, that fifteen to twenty. See, the more we do this, I'm getting the hang of it. Yeah, good. Because my neighbor and I are going to go out and do one with her signs too, and my Hummer, nice. and just kind of try to do a fun one. So, Good. but I think mine, I'm very happy with mine. I thought it was more upbeat. Good. It's okay. Cool. It, it's still serious, but it's a little more upbeat. Okay. okay. Gender, all ages we have in there. Yeah, we'll leave all that as is, and then languages. We'll just change that one. We'll go English all. Yeah, on the languages. Oh, I thought Edit I was that one. Yes. Yeah, see, I don't know where. There we go. So just type in English and then you'll see English all right there. Okay. okay, cool. And then we'll leave it automatic placements. We'll leave it as is. We'll, we'll just scroll down and then we'll hit next. So we're good. We're good here. So hit next. And now we're on the third and final step. So that's it. That's That was the second step. Super simple. Yeah. Um, yeah. This is just giving us yeah. the red error um, because the video is too long for Instagram and that's fine. So it doesn't need to run on Instagram. Whenever you do run Instagram ads, you'll always want to set it up completely separate. Like okay. this ad is just for Facebook and then we'll go create a whole different second ad for Instagram. Okay. Like that's if you ever want to run it on Instagram. 
Um, yeah. That way you can split test. That way you can you can really know the true numbers that's coming in from this one ad and everything is on Instagram, right? So okay. yes. you don't want to blend them. Um, no. So and I might put, I might put one on YouTube if I do. Oh, I know which one I'm going to put on YouTube. The one the video tour I do of the house. Perfect. I'll Perfect. And and always always keep in mind when it's when it's for YouTube specifically when it's for YouTube and then mm -hmm. also for Facebook. You're always holding that phone horizontal. Okay. Wide screen. That's what I've been doing now. Yes. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Thanks. And then, so now here, all we're going to do is, is click on create ad, and then you're going to hit the drop down, and then go to use existing post. And okay. then all we're going to do is go ahead and right there below, select post. Okay. And then it's, we'll just find that there. ad. Yeah. There it is. There it is. Perfect. So click so on we'll it. Click that. Yep. And then hit continue. And then that will upload right away. And then now all we're going to do is we're going to update our call to action button. We're going to add the learn more button. So if you if you scroll down, look at that. You look good. That's a good background. You got good colors on. I like that Thanks. that that blouse or shirt or little sweater thing that you got on. Thanks. You look good. You look really good. So that's why I'm telling you, My logo. your logo perfect. And I'm telling you, even the logo is is a is a bit much. Like it, you're trying to be too fancy. But it, it's cool. Okay. I mean, it's cool. But I'm just saying it's not needed. Like, it's not needed. That teleprompter site had a place for it. So I just dropped it in. Yeah, no, I it's all good. It's all good. And you know what? Rather, here's it. Well, just like you did with the other one, you showed an image of the, of the seller guide. That's actually right. better than just the logo. Okay. Do you think I should change it? No, no, not at all. Don't overthink it. Not at all. But just, you know, future. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, so now I have to put a title too, but does that come later? Did you put a title or no? Well, I, I know on other ones, you've had me put a title on the bottom. You said there's something on the bottom that you have to put, uh, but yes. maybe we haven't gotten to it yet. Yeah. And that's the okay. title, but now it may be too late. Okay. Um, it's, a, it's not a problem. Well, it's not that it's a problem, but in the future, you always want to put the title. That's why I should have, it's, I'm so sorry. It's my, but I, I'm going to take the blame for this one. Where did I Supposed to have done it. I should have reviewed this before we got this far. I should have had you pull it up on your business page first. That's what I normally do. Oh, yeah, um, I do have a title. It says a real estate update for. Okay, Austin. yeah, yeah, yeah. So, the, yeah, so that actually, no, that's the text, or is that oh. the title as well? I don't know. Let's see. Go to your let's let's go to your business page. We're gonna okay. go to your business page. Let's open up that in a new tab. A new tab. Just open up a new tab. On the, I, I liked what I had put on the the thing I I um, recorded it on, which is mm -hmm. called Big Two, the teleprompter one. And I'll tell you, it's pulling. Oh, spring selling season update is what my title was. Perfect. Okay. Let's so, let's, but, let's go to your business page real quick. We're gonna open up your business page, and then we're gonna open up in a second tab, in a in a separate tab. We're gonna open up Kartra because we need okay. your landing page link. So let's open up the business page. Go ahead and click on go to the, and and again we it may be it may be too late. Let's just double check. Go click on those three dots at the top. The text. The three dots. Okay. Ads manager. No. Oh, right not here. on ads manager. Right here. On me? No, right here. Right here. Just click on the three dots above. No, go back. The three dots. We're gonna edit. So the three dots right right. Oh, on right, ads uh, manager, on you mean? On no. ads manager. No, on this. Above, above your video. Okay, gotcha. I'm sorry. Yeah. So let's edit. Go to edit post. And we may not be able to, but let's just double check. Okay. And I'm looking for that verbiage again, because I liked it. Yeah, see, so now that we're in the process, okay, hopefully we, oh, awesome. We were able to get to it. Perfect. Because a lot of times when we're, oh, wow. when, we're when we're already in the process of, of setting up the ad, sometimes we can't get to this part again. So that's why it's always best to, to check this yeah. first before you go set up the ad. So yeah, perfect. So you got spring selling. Oh. So Perfect. that should be on the ad too, right? That's the title. So that's, yeah, that's going to be, that's going to be yeah. in the ad for sure. It's going to be below the video. So click on, and that's, the, that's a good thumbnail. So click on the thumbnail. That's the thumbnail you, you want, you want, right? That's click on it. Yeah. Good. Perfect. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's a good one. That's a good one. Okay, cool. So we're good here. So let's X out. We're good. So now let's just go to Kartra and let's grab the landing page link. Okay. Kartra. Yes. So let's log in here. Let's grab the link for our landing page. Perfect. And now what we're going to do is we're going to just go back to the ads manager and that's going to be our learn more button. So okay. hit 
click on add button. Well, click on it. Okay. Yep. And then you'll just paste it in right here, website URL, and then just click on update post. And so now as that button comes over, you'll see learn more. The title is to the left of it. So you see how that looks? Spring selling season update. It's to the very left of the learn more button. Yeah, looks good. Yeah, so that's that's why the title is so important because we want to fill that 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 it, if it wasn't for your title right there, it'd be an empty spot. Yeah, it would look funny. In okay. Fact, all all that would be there is your dot com, but but mm -hmm. if we can add some verbiage there with some type of call to action, um, mm -hmm. then then that's better. Now here's the deal too. Just just for future, we don't. I mean, we don't got to do it now, but just, I mean, you know what? We we could do it now because you have a real estate update for Austin's. For, for Austin area homeowners. Okay, I'm your local real estate professional serving the greater. Okay, so then if anything here, and, and again, we can either do it now or, or this is just for future knowledge, for future knowledge. It's not a big deal. We're, we're gonna, this is just for future knowledge, most importantly. That okay. title, the title, as you can see, as you can see the way it really looks right here, it's to the right. left of the learn more button. In right. the future, you always want that title to be the call to action. So, so for example, rather than spring selling season update, that's good. Mm -hmm. I mean, that that is good. That's good. It's giving me. It, it it sounds like information. It sounds like an update. That's actually good. But, okay. but I'm not running the ad just to be good. I'm running the ad to have you click my damn button, right? So, right. so rather than just maybe some type of update, maybe, and again that. Spring selling season update that could that could possibly be in the text, and then down there in the title down there I would I would I, again I would rather have some type of call to action I would rather have something like download your free seller guide now, okay. or click click learn more to download your seller guide, or, okay. or click to download your spring seller guide. I got you. Right, some type of call to action to be like okay, damn, she's giving me something. Let me click. Yeah, and Rather I say it. Yeah, of course, you know, the, but if yeah, they yeah, get yeah, that, for sure, for sure, for yeah. sure. So, but, okay, that makes but, sense. but, but that's the only people that are going to really hear that are the people that get that far in the video. And that's not going to mm -hmm. be everyone. Yeah. Right. Well, luckily it's, yeah, luckily it's only a two minute. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Sure. So, so just next time that title, let's always make sure that it, that it's, that it, that it's a call to action. Um, okay referring to the learn more button, referring to right. the seller guide, download your free seller guide. Now download your spring seller guide now. Yeah. Okay. Right? Makes Yes. And, and, and that, that title, it cannot be that long either. So, so it's, it's short and sweet. So right to tell you the truth, that's as much real estate as you're getting spring selling season update. That's pretty much as much space that we can feel right there. Right. Anything else, it would have been dot, dot, dot. Yeah. Okay. You know, well, click so, for your seller guide or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Click for your free seller guide or click for your spring seller guide or something like that. Yeah. So, okay. Good. So, so next time I'm going to put the yeah, picture. We'll do it on, on the third one, third ad. Yeah. Seller's perfect. guide. And then I'll also do something different here. Okay, perfect. So scroll down. We're good here. We got the learn more button. We got the new link um, and everything set up. So click on publish and, and we're good. So now this ad will go live tomorrow right um at 6 a.m and then and then let's talk let's talk in a few days let's talk on the fourth day on the fourth morning the fourth tomorrow. day the fourth morning let's let's schedule a call for then but but in the meantime don't even look at it in the meantime don't even look at it in fact don't even look at it the whole damn time look at it for the first time when you and i jump on okay okay uh, uh, go do you think it went yeah it, it went it went so let, now let's click on the the drop down at the top Right there next to view more variations to the right of that, there's that drop down to the right of, of all these ads of all, all the these way to the all right the way down. Up? No down. Oh, right I there. see. To the right, to the right. No, not oh, to the way. right of it. To the right yeah, of it. Little... Yeah, that drop down. Yeah, click on that, and then just scroll down to Facebook desktop newsfeed, and let's just look at it, what it what it looks like you know in real time as people scroll through the newsfeed. This will give us a, a good idea of what. What it really looks like. So oh yeah, there. So there goes your learn more. Yeah. You know, mm -hmm. So so go ahead and click on it. Click on learn more. Let's make sure you know everything. Everything clicks and everything looks good. We click on learn more, 
it brings it straight, brings us straight to this landing page mm -hmm. and, and we're good. So perfect. So good. one last thing we'll do real quick. Let's um, go back to the ads manager. The, the right after you, you, you publish and now, now we're in motion and Facebook going to review it and you'll get the email later on. Um, mm -hmm. And then it'll go live tomorrow. Right after we click on that publish, what we want to get in the habit of right away is to then go create a custom audience. Right. Oh, so really? we want to create a custom audience of everyone who's going to start watching this one. So okay. let's X out of this to the left, top left X. Let's X out of this. And then, and then it's going to bring us back to the dashboard where we're going to click, we're going to X out one selected, one selected, one selected. So let's just, okay. let's just close out all of those. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. So now all we're going to do is click on the dots to the top left. Let's click on those dots and let's go to audiences. So this is all going to be on a YouTube video that I can watch. Yeah, for sure. Okay, thanks. Because, yeah, when you take a, someone through step by step like you, you're doing, then as long as you can go step by step, it's it, it can be done. I could do it. So Awesome. So now let's click on the blue one, create oh. audience. Oh. Okay, I see seller like uh, custom yes. audience now. Yep, custom audience. And then we're going to go with video. And then next. Okay, cool. So now all we're going to do is we're going to choose a content type and we'll go with 25%. So go 25% and then we're going to choose that video. So go ahead and click on choose videos at the top. And then we'll just look for that video. Choose like this one here. No, choose, choose videos to the right. Oh, okay. This one. So we just check this, yep. right? Check that. Click confirm. And then all we're gonna do is we're gonna name it. So go ahead and click on click confirm. And then we'll give it a name. And then um, so just like you named the title on the ad, name it the same, yeah. and then just go ahead and put in parentheses 25%. Okay, I'm just trying to remember what the name was. Spring selling season update. And then 25%. Perfect. Yep, 25%. Cool. <laughs> and then create audience. So we set up the conversion ad, we set up a custom audience, and now it's set to go live tomorrow. So click on done. And there is the custom audience. Perfect. So, so that's what we're getting is we're, we're creating these audiences of, of those who are watching. We're creating the audience of those who are landing on the page. There goes your seller guide page visitors only. Right. Mm -hmm. So, right. so, so these are, this is data. This is good stuff. These are people that you're, you're collecting. All you're doing is you're collecting this data of people that are performing these actions and engaging with your stuff. And this is your leverage. So again, this is where everyone gets it wrong. In the future, at, when we get to ad number, ad number four, five, six, seven, and on, it's all about mm -hmm. retargeting these people. Because okay. we're, 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 we're running ads to, to market to a local market, 20 miles mm -hmm. around this address. So okay. now it just comes down to staying in front of them. But staying in front of the ones who are, who, who are actually engaging. And, and what right. are they doing to engage? They're watching our videos. They're clicking wow. on our website. They just haven't opted in yet. The moment yeah. you opt in, then you're in my custom audience of seller guide leads. Then I'll start excluding you from seeing future ads. Right. But if you haven't landed in that audience yet, seller guide leads, you're going to keep seeing my stuff. Mm -hmm. If you're okay. watching it, right? If you're watching it, right. if you're landing on my webpage, you're going to keep seeing my stuff. And that's what creates the omnipresence. That's what creates you. that 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 credibility and that social proof that they keep seeing you. That's right. the magic. They have to keep seeing you. Mm -hmm. You know, um, and that's that's retargeting. But that again, that's what everybody doesn't do. Everybody runs one ad and expects to get seventy-seven leads on one damn ad when it went to a cold market and no one even knows you yet. Right. You know. So trust me. I'm I'm we, go ahead. I'm sorry. I'm in it. Oh, I'm sorry. I know it, it interrupted you. I'm in it to continue to try to 
Yes. It, it, yeah. And it's all about just staying consistent. You already have what it takes. We're learning the ad side on this end. You have what it takes by doing the videos. And, and I'm just telling you that you're, you're, you're doing way better a job than you need to be doing. Like dumb it down a little bit. You don't even need the editing. You don't need nothing fancy. You're, you're doing them just perfect. So, mm. so if Thank you can you. keep that going and that's where another, another area where everyone drops the ball is 99% of your industry are camera shy. Yeah. So, so you got everything that it takes, Christine, like you have everything it takes. Now, all it takes is consistency on top of it. And, and, and you, you conquer that area. Like Austin, they have nothing on you. Like I'm telling you, you're going to dominate that area as long as you stay consistent with what we're doing. Okay. I'm trying. You know? so, so and you think videos uh, for sure are better than like, like just putting an image. Yeah. It, now we'll do both. Why don't we do both? Why don't, why don't we go in and get some more video videos done? You know, if, if you have the time and, 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 and yeah, if you have the time, but maybe next time let's even, let's even test an image, but the oh. image has to be you. The image has to be a headshot of you. Oh, okay. I wouldn't do an image of a, some random house. Okay. Like, like let's like, it's all about your face. Like that's what the branding effect is happening right now. The, the branding effect has taken place right now. Like that's what's going on. People are seeing okay. you in their newsfeed and, and it's either going to be a video of you or it's going to be an image of you. Okay. It's not going to be anything else. So okay. that could be something we test next is, is, is an image of a, a headshot of you. I did a really nice, let me show you this one and see what you think. I mean, it's another one that is, um, and, that is what you would call it. Uh, it's edited. So you might not like it, but I don't know how you get to, how did we get to videos that other time? Just we just through, go to, is it a video you're gonna show me or or it's a kind of a video but it's it's not a video like where i'm talking it's okay just, yeah the, it's just a, a slideshow right like a like a yeah it is i thought it was cute yeah, i'm there so as long as your face is there then, then cool. But, yes. but it's okay. not going to, it's not going to, it's not going to do much for an ad. No. So, okay. so an image of you, look at you, you look good. Like an image, an image of you. Let, let's, let's run that next. Let's run an image okay. and, and get a few images. Here's what I would do if I were you, as you go out to that listing with your girlfriend and you guys go start to, you know, do some content, take some, take some pictures of you as well of you standing inside the house, maybe you standing outside of the house, have her take some pictures of you and hold the, hold the phone horizontal. Okay. Okay. Even, even images, that image needs to be horizontal or, or square, but, but not vertical, not, not, not vertical, um, horizontal or square, Ho horizontal, Ho hold the phone horizontal okay. and just take some close ups, take some, some headshots of just you in front of the house and, and, okay. and take a few, not just one, take a few, because as we run image ads, that's how you run image ads. You, you run image ads by, by, by running a few at a time. Okay. Okay. So All right. let's okay. talk in four days and review this ad and then go from there. I'm going to make the next appointment for Monday then. Okay. Awesome. Christine. Thank you so much. Okay. Have a good Thank one. Thank you. I appreciate okay. it. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.